My name is Terry Collinsworth and I'm the director of the International Rights Advocates. Uh, we bring uh, human rights cases all over the world and I now have one in the Democratic Republic of Congo, the DRC, where I represent 14 families. Eight of the families are, represent children who were injured in mine collapses. So the children have amputated legs, smashed pelvises, they survived horrific tunnel collapses. And six of the families are parents of children who were killed in mine collapses in the DRC. So we brought this case on behalf of both groups uh, in federal court in the United States. The children who are artisanal miners in the DRC have the most horrific conditions. It's worse than anything I've seen in my 30-some years of being a human rights lawyer. The children are given shovels and they dig tunnels to reach the cobalt veins and they dig in very loose rock so they don't have any protective beams, no protective equipment, and they dig into the sides of these shale-like hills and inevitably the tunnels collapse. Every child and parent that I interviewed knew someone, either in their family or in their community, who lost a child to a mine collapse. It is hot. The dust from the cobalt is unhealthy in many respects. It causes respiratory problems. And the children make between one and two dollars a day for risking their lives. We have sued five of the largest technology companies there are. Apple, Google, Microsoft, Dell, and Tesla. And what we want from them, first and foremost, is to take care of the people that have been injured or killed in mine collapses, getting them their cobalt. Uh, these are, in, in the case of Apple and Microsoft and Tesla, they claim to be trillion dollar companies and they have turned a blind eye to what they know is going on in the DRC and that is children are being maimed and killed. Second, we want them to change their practices dramatically. There's no excuse for using Stone Age primitive conditions to mine cobalt that goes into these fancy futuristic devices. So that's what we want. We want the families to be taken care of and we want them to change their practices, make the mine conditions safe for adults who make a fair and decent wage and that allows them to send their kids to school rather than putting them in the mines. I think this conference is very important because it's going to bring together different audiences of people who care about different aspects of uh, the electronic sector. And I'm hoping to be able to communicate with uh, new people about how tragic the situation is in the DRC for the miners and uh, hope that they will take home to their countries and their organizations uh, an added mission which is to help stop this horrific practice.